Hi there, it's Alan from Cool Toys and our new Edinburgh scooter shop is now open. So today we're going to have a quick look at taking the motor off the Xiaomi Pro 2. Um, this is one of the only things we've not put on the channel yet. Uh, a motor strip down. So we've got the motor off here and we've got the motor stripped. Okay, so my other video shows how to take this motor off, but for people who haven't seen that, you peel back the reflector, that reveals the four screws, and you do that on both sides, then this part is removed. You don't need to remove these two, then you've just got the nuts to remove. So you will need a 18 mil spanner to remove both the nuts. You do not need to remove the wires for the three phases to the motor. You can get this motor out like how we've got it set up here um, and sitting on the bench. So, if you think you've got a problem with the motor, what are you actually looking for? Well, a visual inspection on the motor, you're really looking for any obvious signs. So, burnt coil, broken wires, any scraping on the magnets, any magnets off, any of that stuff obvious then that's that's the motor trashed you. You're not repairing this. Um, this internal part of the, the motor is not available so it's just a new motor. Um, obviously the bearing as well so if the bearing falls apart it's a rubber sealed bearing. If that falls apart, it starts shaking, the whole thing starts vibrating inside, it starts destroying the magnets, um, and ultimately that is the end of the motor. Um, you have to be careful taking this motor out. The magnets are very strong, and it's quite easy um, to catch your fingers in it. And that's just the plate from the other side, which just has those, has little clips, but it's also got a dab of glue on each. To hold it in. So, the other thing we're going to do on another video is we're going to put this motor onto the rear of this scooter. Now, in order to do that, you need the rear motor conversion plate. This is the latest one that takes the disc. Makes things much easier if the disc stays on the back. Um, so, This goes into the hub and then fits on with the disc on the right side. Obviously you need to extend the motor cables along to the back, work it away getting them through. So this is not an easy conversion. Also you need to cut the chassis so that these will hold it. So you're looking at a cut along here and here. So most most people's not really wanting to, to do that. But we're going to do one in the shop. See how this scooter handles rear wheel drive. Um, see if it's any better. Most of these scooters are front wheel drive. And putting the motor on the back adds additional problems. Like, you know, destroying it on curbs and stuff. Um, so I hope this helps and can give people a, a good look at this motor assembly opened up. So this is on a Xiaomi Pro 2. Hope this helps.
And we've got more information on the new website, edinburghscooters.co.uk.